I'm going to be talking about how to make the butterfly today. And the first thing you need to know is that you're going to have markers set up. So you're going to have groups of five here, here, here. And that's where the butterfly is going to land. And so when you get to a butterfly area on the right side of the work, you're going to bring the yarn forward, slip five stitches purlwise, so as if you're going into purl, and then bring the yarn back, move the marker, and you can do that in any order, it won't really matter. The important thing is that you leave this strand loose. You want it sort of dangling down. You can even hold onto it with your thumb when you knit the next stitch. And that's all there is to the front side. Now we'll go to the back side. We're on the back now, and we're going to place beads on the back side, and they'll actually pop out to the front, even though you can see them a little in the back. So you can see we have our strands across, and when you get to one stitch outside of the strand, so on each outside part of that five stitch grouping, we're going to place a bead. So first you put the bead over top of your crochet hook, and you're gonna need a little steel crochet hook for this, about a size 10 is what I use. And you're going to grab the bead stitch with your crochet hook, and then pull that stitch through the bead. Usually I have people slip the stitch, but this time I'm gonna have you put it back on and then purl that stitch. You're go going to just purl the next five. You're gonna move the marker and now you wanna bead on the next outside. All right, so I am at a butterfly and I want to pull these three stitches together so that they kind of form the body. And what I'm doing is I'm gonna take my right needle and put it down into them from top to bottom. And I'm gonna pull them up and put them over the left needle. Then I'm going to knit them together. I'm going to knit the next stitch and I'm going to pull one stitch over the other. So that gives you a nice butterfly shape. You can also push your beads a little bit more forward. And that's all there is to it. Let's do one more. So you're going to knit two, you're going to take your left, your right needle, put it down and grab the three strands and then pull them up over the left needle. Now you could take the left needle and go right in, but I think it's a little easier to do that. You're going to knit those three together, then you're going to knit the next stitch and pull the first stitch over the second. And that gives you like a little stitch there. I think it looks pretty cute. So that's how you make a butterfly.